Emily Deem is live at Green Bay's Metro Boat Launch. There is a huge walleye tournament about to kick off in just minutes, and she's there live. Good morning, Em. Yeah, Rachel P. Just minutes this tournament's going to kick off, and I'm here now on the boat with father son duo John and Brad, and they're taking part in the 13th annual Cabela's National Team Championship. Guys, thank you so much for being with me before you head out of the water. Um, where are you from? We're from Genoa City, Wisconsin. And you've actually been here in the Green Bay area for a week. You've been doing some pre fishing. Can you tell me about that? Yeah, the weather's been really great. We've uh, found some good fish and now we've got a northeast wind that's kind of changed our plan a little bit so we're going to go out there and see if we can mix it up and find some find those same fish yeah you were talking to me about walleye fishing i mean there's a lot to think about you've been, actually been using this to help you this week can you tell me about that yeah that's our locator our graph it's got mapping on it it's got sonar we've got structure scan uh, we can set waypoints on it there's a lot of different things that we can do with it it's a great tool to have on a boat uh, walleye fishing is very specific to places that you want to be so you can mark and locate the fish and it's something we use on a very regular basis. And Brad, you actually had to qualify for this tournament. Can you tell me about how you got here? Uh, we fish a World Walleye Association, the WWA uh, Channel Lakes chapter. Um, we qualified through that this year and last year. Um, I don't know. It's a uh, that's what we've been fishing. That's how we got here. Yeah. Qualified through that. Tell me about fishing with your dad. You told me you've been fishing ever since you could crawl, right? Yeah, I've been fishing with my dad my whole life. I mean, I love fishing more than anything, and especially with my dad. I mean, that's something we enjoy doing together. Um, we've done it our whole lives together, and it's just a passion that we've always had, and that's what we love to do. Okay, and between the two of you, who catches the most fish? Fred, definitely. Oh, your dad said you. Yeah, that could be true. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, best luck to you guys. Dan Palmer, you are ready to get this thing started here in just a little bit. But why don't you tell me about this tournament, where they're going to be headed out to on the bay? Uh, they're going to head out into the bay. They can go all the way up to Gills Rock, which is about 65 miles up. It goes The boundary goes across to the Michigan border, so there's no Michigan waters allowed. They can fish any of the tributaries anywhere they can float their boat. And look at all these boats out here. Dan's telling me to wrap this thing up, you guys, because he's got to get them out onto the water. So you know what? We're going to send it back to you. But you can learn more on our website. Thanks, guys, and good luck. Thank you.